Welcome to Pipeline Health's educational series on Paragon Basics for Nursing Clinical Care Station Overview. Today I'm going to describe how to log on to Clinical Care Station. On the hospital desktop, locate the link for the Los Angeles Market app portal. It's the one that has a circle behind the building. Go ahead and double click that to launch Pipeline Health App Portal. On this main screen, you will notice all script Citrix. Double click on this link. This will take you into the Citrix server. Type in your username and password, then click on Log On. You now have access to the Citrix storefront. This allows you into many applications within Paragon. Directly from the storefront, you can see that the emergency department dashboard is located, as well as Paragon Clinical Hub. To access Clinical Care Station, you're going to click on Prod. Once in Prod Station, you will click on Paragon. Once you are in Paragon, you're going to click on this icon with a folder that says Clinical Care Station. Double click on this. This now will launch Clinical Care Station. This is the primary application for nursing care. This is the log on to the application to Paragon Clinical Care Station. Type in your username and password, then click OK. You've now been launched into the Clinical Care Station. Once you are in Clinical Care Station, you must click on Care Glance to go to the main splash screen. Once you are in the main splash screen, you might be defaulted to a specific location. If not, you may click on the drop down and select the appropriate unit you're in. In this case, I'm going to click Med Search, select Retrieve on the far right to pull up the list of patients that are in the Med Search unit. Be sure to look at the title bar in Care Glance. In the title bar, it'll display the application you're under and the name of the current user. Verify that your name displays under current user. If it does not, make sure you sign off and log in with the appropriate credentials. On the secondary toolbar, there is a legend that lets you know what these acronyms, shortcuts, icons indicate. You also have the ability to assign a patient to yourself. So once you know the assignment, you can click on the assign checkbox to assign the patient. For example, let's say patient training 101 is assigned to me. I'm going to click on the assign box and select the appropriate shift. If it's day shift, you select day. If it's night shift, you select night. Select day. And you may also click on the checkbox to assign selected shift to all selected patient visits for current location while window remains open. Click OK. I'm also going to assign patient train 104, patient train 107, and patient train 108. Once the encounters are assigned, click on the assign patient filter box next to the location and click retrieve. Then it'll only display the assigned patients. 
If you need to go back and view the entire list, be sure to uncheck the Assign Patient box, click Retrieve, and it'll pull up the entire list.